There are things, and now this same-sex marriage is no good. Being gay and being a homosexual is not popular. It's not popular. Quit making it a fad. It's nasty. And they want to take over our country with that homosexuality crap. Let me tell you something. The demon principality of homosexuality is coming down in America. Shout to the Lord like you're going crazy. These demons are trying to incite judgment to our country. But the Christians got to stand up. We got to decree and proclaim boldly as kings. That ain't happening here. That's going to stop here. Oh, brother, that's hate speech. That ain't, we get a lot of homosexuals saved here. They get delivered here. Come on, y'all ain't talking to me. Homosexuality is not normal. It is not natural. It's demonic. And now that spirit has come in the church. You got a lot of pastors that's gay, bishops that's gay, twitching and got so much sugar in their hips, sugar in their wrists. Every time they walk or move their hand, I'm like, a real man, when we see that, we're like, what? what? One eye big, one eye small, what, what, what's that? You know, because the real one, we don't, we don't even know how to move our hand like that. All that bending and twitching and stuff. You can tell them got that sugar in their tank because God didn't make no man to move like that. That's right, I said it. If you got sugar in your waist, something wrong with you. Huh? That's right, I said it. Some of these guys, they're so, they're so feminine, you know, they'd be talking, get some darn bass in your voice. What's wrong with you? I know you didn't pop out of the womb talking like that. Put some bass in it. And get delivered. Now give God a shout of praise if you know the principality of homosexuality is coming down in this generation. Oh, they have the nerve to say in the church. I know it could be true for some people, but they'll say stuff like, oh, you know, if, if you preach on something like that, you must be struggling with it. The devil is a lie. I don't struggle with that. I like what God made me to like. Hello? Oh, he preached on that because he's sure that's the devil is a lie. I don't struggle with that. You better get out of here with that foolishness. No, I'm 100%, 200% real man. That's right. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna tell you something. Our nation is in trouble, but we can turn it around. And I'm an apostle that has been sent to the country. I believe that even this turnaround, and I'm not a political person, but I'm gonna say this, every year God will speak to me about the election and he wouldn't say nothing to me. And the more I watched him, I'm like, you know, this couldn't be our president. 
but I didn't say nothing. That's one thing about me as a prophet. See, some prophets get in trouble because they want to speak on issues that God ain't even talking to them. It, I don't care if God has talked to you every year. If he don't say nothing, just shut up. Because sometimes he's trying to keep it a mystery from you until he's ready for you to know about it. But ever since he's got in office, the first bill he signed was against, was for the preachers so that the world wouldn't come in and take our 501c3 status. Now, it don't matter what you think about Trump, he's already president, and as a Christian, we're supposed to pray for him. He may have his problems, but one of the things I've seen, he is protecting the church. Because the, the government, they want to come in and tax us on all the billions of dollars we get in revenue. He said, we're going to stop that. Give God a shout of praise for that. The next thing he does, all the other presidents could have put an embassy in Israel. Israel gave us land free for one dollar to put an embassy. Not one president would do it because of the confusion. But he boldly went in there, put an embassy to stand up for Israel. That's putting us in the right standing with God. Come on, y'all ain't hearing me. No matter what his problems are, he has made some moves that is causing God to favor this nation. The third thing is he signed a bill that same-sex marriage is no good. I told y'all homosexuality is coming down in America. Pray for our president. Pray for him. Pray for him. He may not have everything right, but pray for him. We are commanded to. I know that this is the beginning of turning the war around 